characteristics of chemical reactions evolution of a gas formation of a precipitate change in color change in temperature and change in state let us discuss them one by one in detail evolution of a gas we can characterize some chemical reactions by the evolution of a gas let us understand this with the help of few examples one when zinc granules react with dilute sulfuric acid bubbles of hydrogen gas are produced When dilute hydrochloric acid is poured over sodium carbonate in a beaker carbon dioxide gas is evolved Now we will discuss about second characteristic that is formation of precipitate when two reactants are mixed if one of the products formed is insoluble in water then it is called precipitate thus we can say that a precipitate is a solid product which separates out from the solution during a chemical reaction let us understand this with few examples one when potassium iodide solution is added to a solution of lead nitrate a yellow precipitate of lead iodide is formed when dilute sulfuric acid is added to barium chloride solution a white precipitate of barium sulfate is formed Now we will discuss the third characteristic that is change in color. Let us understand this with few examples. 1. When citric acid reacts with potassium permanganate solution, the purple color of potassium permanganate solution becomes colorless. When sulfur dioxide gas is passed through acidified potassium dichromate solution the orange color of potassium dichromate solution changes to green the fourth characteristic is change in temperature students do you know some chemical reactions produce heat energy which makes the reaction mixture hot whereas some chemical reactions absorb heat energy which makes the reaction mixture cold so when we talk of change in temperature it can be rise in temperature of the reaction or fall in temperature of the reaction let us understand this with few examples one calcium oxide also known as lime and quick lime when react with water the slaked lime is formed and a lot of heat is produced this heat raises the temperature due to which the reaction mixture becomes hot these type of reactions are called exothermic reactions which means heat producing reaction 2 when barium hydroxide is added to ammonium chloride and mixed with a glass rod then barium chloride ammonia and water are formed a lot of heat energy is absorbed due to which the reaction mixture becomes very cold it is an endothermic reaction which means heat absorbing reaction now we will discuss about fifth characteristic that is change in state let us understand this with an example when a wax is burned water and carbon dioxide are formed in this example you can see that wax is a solid water is a liquid whereas carbon dioxide is a gas this means that during the combustion reaction of wax the physical state changes
from solid to liquid and gas.